How are you guys doing today? This is Derek House with DHFTNS.com and today I'm going to show you guys a really quick and delicious way to prepare your sweet potatoes. So let's get to it. First thing you're going to want to do is take out however many sweet potatoes you'd like to prepare today. As you see, I took out three and we're just going to go ahead and wash them. All I do to wash my sweet potatoes is take a scrubber and scrub them under cold water. If there's any weird particles or dirt or anything else on them, obviously go ahead and scrub that off. The next thing you're going to want to do is cut your ends off. And now cut your sweet potato into quarter inch slivers. So they should be about that big. Once you're done cutting them, they should look something like this. Next up, you can either use a baking sheet or if you don't have a baking sheet big enough for your sweet potatoes, you can double layer some tin foil like I did, which also works great as a baking sheet. Before we put our cut sweet potatoes on top of our tin foil or baking sheet, go ahead and spray some nonstick cooking spray on it. If you don't want to use nonstick cooking spray, you can brush on some olive oil as well. Now take your cut sweet potatoes and just place them on the tin foil or baking sheet. Now we're going to put another coat of nonstick cooking spray on, but this coat is going to go on top of the sweet potatoes. Or if you don't want to use a spray, you can brush on a light coat of olive oil. And now take some kosher salt and put it on top of the sweet potatoes. We're going to cook them on 350 for 50 minutes and then take them out, flip them over and cook them for an additional 45 to 50 minutes. So it's been around 50 minutes now. Go ahead and take them out and we're going to flip them over. Now that they're out of the oven, just turn them over. All we're going to do before we put them back in the oven is put another light coat of spray on them or brush another light coat of olive oil on them if you're using olive oil instead. And some more kosher salt. And back into the oven they go on 350, usually around 50 minutes for me or until they start to look crispy. So it's been an additional 50 minutes. Go ahead and take your cut sweet potatoes out now and let them cool. The last thing I like to do is throw a little bit of ground cinnamon on top of them. And there are your cut sweet potatoes. As you guys saw, the cut sweet potatoes are done. Now I'm just going to try one for you. You can pick them up. They're almost like sweet potato waffle fries or something. I know a lot of you already probably love sweet potatoes. This recipe will just make you love them that much more. The salt brings all the flavor to the ends of the sweet potato fry. Absolutely delicious. I just want to thank you guys for watching. If you liked my cut sweet potatoes recipe, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. It motivates me to keep making these. If you aren't already subscribed, you can do so by clicking right around here on the screen coming up. And by subscribing, if you aren't already, you'll get an email every week telling you I upload a new video. Comments or suggestions go down below. I do try and respond to everybody. All right, guys, I want to thank you again for watching. I got some sweet potatoes to finish. Stay healthy.